Nice. Partir to mud. Partir to mud. What does your island look like? Leave me be, Ranaisi. I do not want to talk. Hello. I am Lair, the village leader. Well, I was the leader of this village. Hello, the Sade. I am the legate of the merchant congregation. There are Onol Manawi among the Logaid Blau. I did not know that. What do you want from me? I've heard a lot of things about this village of Eden, but I'd like to hear your version. Hmm. I'm not sure Roy have the answers to all of your questions, but I'll try. Tell me about the arrival of the people of Teleme, and how you received them. The priests were roaming around the village. They were saying that it was the place where their saint had lived. They were asking questions, talking about the Lloyd, and all these things. One morning they were building houses next to ours. And we had new neighbors. The priests told me that they had managed to convert you. How did that happen? As long as we refused to listen to them, they were violent, and they destroyed some of our sanctuaries. So we let them talk. And now that they think that we love their god, they leave us alone. Some of the things they say are beautiful, and their magic is impressive. But we do not forget our spirits. One of the theologians told me that you would help them in their research. They wanted to find tracks of the old sage, of the one they call Saint Matthäus, and they were rummaging through everything. Our Donegad did not want to tell them anything, because the old sage is sacred here. But since they violently interrogated everyone, I thought it wise to guide them to the place where the stones were. What happened to your warriors? Why did they have to leave the village? They did not accept the presence of the priests and their questions. They tried to retake the village. They even asked Derdra, the chief of Vedlug, for her help. So, the priests called the Sol Lassa, the Burning Sons, and they killed many of them. Oi asked for peace. And the others left us. They wanted to join Vedlug. Perhaps they have done so. Aren't you angry after all that happened? No. I mourn those who died, of course. And the Vorstirent. But this village may be our opportunity. Your opportunity for what? For the Renaigse to understand who we are. Not savages, nor monsters, but men, perhaps wiser than they are. I think I know who stole the tablets. Really? I believe those who were exiled from your village seek vengeance because the missionaries forced them to leave. They must have taken the tablets with the help of someone else who stayed here. You may be right, but you may also be wrong. Since you do not want to talk, I will have to tell the Mother Cardinal to send the Ordo Luminous. The Inquisitors will make you confess the name of the person who helped the exiles. I think the name of the woman you are looking for is Vindwal. She helps the priests who seek the old sage. If she's helping the priests, why would she betray them now? 
Her son is one of the warriors who had to leave the village. He is filled with anger and fury. If you go talk to her, please do not hurt her. She is but a mother who acted according to her son's wishes. I have no intention of hurting her, but things may not be so simple when it comes to her son. I have to go. Like so many others. I knew that the story would be more complex than we'd been told. I find it regrettable that my colleagues aren't more honest when it comes to history. Nothing solid has ever been built on lies. Either way, the resentment here is strong enough for a theft to occur. Greetings. Are you Vindwal? Bird tier, Tumad. Yes, that is me. What do you want? Listen, I know you helped the exiles to steal the tablets of Saint Mateus. No, this is not true. It wasn't me. There's no point in denying it. I know you did it for your son who had to leave the village. If you know that, then you know that Oi don't have the tablets. So what do you want from me? Tell me where the exiles are. I must retrieve these tablets. You're asking me to betray my son. Promise me that you won't hurt him. I promise. But if he reacts violently, I'll have to defend myself. Then Oi hope he'll be reasonable. Bran and the others are hiding in the woods, beyond the Circle of Stone. Thank you, Vindwal. This battle!
Here's the place that Vindwal indicated. The exiles must be near. These people have been banished already. There's no need to add death to their list of punishments. Let's try not to fight them. Don't worry, we'll be discreet. In that case, we should avoid taking the left path. If I remember correctly what that woman said, it's booby-trapped. Do it! What are you doing here? I'm not here to fight you, but I must retrieve the tablets of Saint Matthias. What? How do you know we have them? And how? Not for thee. We will not give them back! We lost our homes and families, so the priests lose their sacred stones! I will do anything to retrieve these tablets. Are you really prepared to die to prevent me doing so? You sure possess the arrogance of Renaixe. Eitmu! May the enlightened protect me in this battle! To my help! And death to the others! May the shadow engulf our enemies! Move away! Things are about to get dicey! It's a great shame that things have gone this far. What are you doing here? Oi was worried for my son. Oi wanted to make sure that everything was fine. I'm sorry, Vindwal, but I had to resort to force. Your son and his friends are dead. No! Kerton Sedag! Why did he have to seek revenge? Ma Rentam! I am genuinely sorry. Go! Leave me alone! We must now return them to the earth.
I retrieved your relics. Thank you. Thank you immensely. Thanks to them, we will be able to continue our research on St. Matthias. I am curious to know who is responsible for this theft. The culprit must be brought to justice. The exiles did it, and they are dead, so you won't have to chase them. May the enlightened forgive them for their crimes. I suspect they left you with no choice. Those natives were filled with rage. In any case, you would do well to keep a better watch on your discoveries in the future. You should also pay more attention to those who share this village with you. This theft would never have happened had you truly been in harmony with the natives. But that is precisely what we desire more than anything. Oh, we may have been a bit clumsy in the beginning, but we'll make sure to improve things in the future. You really were a great help. I would be most grateful if you agreed to continue helping us. I might come back at some point, but alas, I'm very busy. Naturally. Either way, we are certainly capable of continuing our research without you. Actually, I must go back to my work. Our next expedition must depart as soon as possible. Your next expedition? Our brave researchers must continue to follow the tracks of our founder on this island. In the meantime, here, take this as a token of gratitude for the help you gave us. Thank you. I hope your expedition will be a success.
third tier to mud. Why are you wearing the same clothes as other knights? Your Excellency, the Enlightened must be sending you. I am afraid we may need your help once more. Did you hear about what happened? One of our theologians who went on the expedition came back in a very concerning state. Do not worry. I will go see him. I hope you will know how to cure him. Poor Brother Fidelis is suffering terribly. I must leave you. Goodbye. May the Enlightened always keep you in their divine... Oh, there you are, Your Excellency. The Enlightened has heard my prayers. What's going on? Where are the others? After deciphering the content of the tablets, they went north to continue their research in some swamps. Oh, but they must have encountered problems. Brother Fidelis came back here, and he was in a dreadful state. He most likely came to seek help, but he fainted. It's impossible for us to know what happened to them. I'm not a doctor. But I may be able to examine him. Oh, please do. Any help would be appreciated. We've done our best, but our magic has proved inefficient. And the healer we sent for will certainly arrive too late from San Mateus. This man is burning up with fever, and he bears several bite marks and traces of blows. The blows did not put him in this state. He looks like a victim of poisoning. With the right antidote, I think we could get him back on his feet. Have you tried giving him any antipoison? Of course, but to no avail. And what if it were a hex cast by the heretics? No matter what happens, you always suspect them. This man was in the swamp. We know it's home to many creatures that we have a poor knowledge of. But local healers will certainly know which antidote to use. We could ask Lair. He will direct us to someone who understands remedies. On Olmanawi, you've come back to see old Lair. I heard that you managed to retrieve the tablets. Did Vindwal tell you? Yes, and divorced Tyrant. My heart bleeds at the news of our brother's death. I was hoping that peace with the Renaixe was possible. I'm starting to think it is an illusion. Well, we will see what the winds bring us. I need your advice. You may already know that one of the researchers came back wounded from the expedition. I heard about it. He has all the symptoms of a poisoning, but the anti-poisons we gave him had no effect. He must have been bitten by a creature of the swamp, and we're looking for a healer who would know of a suitable antidote. So, you came to see me. Interesting. Our neighbors did not think for one moment that we could be helpful. Alas, our Donegad is one of the exoils. But Vindwal knows plants well. She will know. Thank you. I will go see her. 
I hope she agrees to help us. I have to go. Like so many. Hard to believe that you are Lugate Blau. The others do not look like us. Here you are again. What do you want? I have come to ask for your help. Lair told me you know about remedies. I do know a few of them. I have learned about plants. I used to want to become a Donegad. One of the researchers came back wounded from the expedition. Apparently, he was bitten by a creature of the swamp. And now he has the Lawolan fever. We have a good knowledge about this affliction. He will die if he does not receive proper treatment. Do you know which antidote should be given to him? My son died because of these people. They neglect us and treat us like children. Why should I give you my knowledge to save one of them? I'm sorry about what happened to Bran. ...and about the priest's behavior towards you. But are you really prepared to let a man die when you could save him? To perpetuate the cycle of vengeance? <sighs> no, no. You're right. I will explain to you how to create the antidote. Thank you, Vindwal. You are in Eden. You're safe. I... Well, was I unconscious for a long time? The, the other members of the expedition, they are in danger. The swamp is so hostile. We weren't prepared for it. S some of our people have d disappeared. What caused these wounds? A nightmarish creature. The swamp is full of them. A colleague and I had left to fetch some help when we were attacked. I managed to run away, but I don't know what happened to him. As for those who were at the camp, you must go help them. Show me the location of your colleagues on the map. I will join them. There. Please, hurry. Thank you. You should rest now.
Protect me in this battle. To my health. And death to the others! Yeah. Yeah. Things are about to get messy. in this battle. Death to the others! Be careful! Your armor is falling apart!
once again.